it reveals the secrets of the past, the present, and what may come to be. Most would think me fortunate to own such a book. But I can only use it in service to others. That is my curse. It wakes, tormenting me once more. Feeding on the mysteries of this world. Unraveling them into opportunity. That opportunity for whom? Welcome, my friends, to Total War Warhammer 3. I am excited about this. I'm so excited about this. Uh, and we are going to jump straight into a campaign. We are... Uh, we're, we're not going to play the prologue. Uh, we're going to just do a, a new campaign. And, yeah, I am really, really excited for this game. You have no idea. You have this no idea. Has been sundered by a tide of arcane energy. The winds of magic turned into a maelstrom. The tome of fate drew me north to find out why. It guided me to a distant fortress steeped in blood. A battle was fought there. Though long over, the spirit still lingered. In the shadow of a broken portal, the trail ended. It was here the tome conversed with the dead. They told of Urson, the bear god of Kislev, lost in darkness. A noble prince ventured to save him, yet he strayed from the path and was corrupted by chaos. Savior became executioner. A single shot bound in faith forsaken pierced Urson's heart. And so the bear god roared. The tide that broke the world. Spirits, where lies Urson now? Is he here? In the north. They are the master in the realm of chaos of the Forge of Souls. Is he alive? Wounded and dying. Embraced in shadow. What shadow? A demon's? A master of the dark. <laughs> I knew who shackled the bear. Bellacor. Only a fool would challenge Bellacor. And yet, the power of a dying god, there is no greater prize. A mere drop of Urson's blood would break my curse, ending my servitude to this accursed book. Free to profit from its secrets. But Urson is locked in the Forge of Souls, deep in the realm of chaos, and I cannot enter this nightmarish domain. All routes have been sealed by the Maelstrom. There must be a way. Ah, the tome unveils a spell to summon a portal, one to bypass the maelstrom and create a door into chaos. Knowledge to bargain, for I need an ally, one who is tempted by the power of the god bear and can withstand the horrors within. Damn, this is exciting. This is so exciting. 
All right, so uh, full disclosure, I do not know anything about the Warhammer universe. I know no lore whatsoever, uh, but I have played Total War Warhammer 2 uh, quite a bit, and I love the game, and uh, that's why I'm jumping into Total War Warhammer 3, because Total War Warhammer 2 was so great, and... I, 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 I do love the universe of Warhammer, but I, I just don't know the stories. I, I, I don't know the origins. I don't know the the intricacies uh, of Warhammer. But I really want to. Uh, so if you do know the lore of Warhammer, I would really appreciate it if you would uh, let me know about the lore in in the, the comments below because it, it it would really be cool to to know a lot more about the lore uh, of total war warhammer and um uh, of course i do own uh, total war warhammer one i do own total war warhammer two and now i own total war warhammer three and uh, when the, the the map that combines those three maps comes out I will, of course, be playing on that as well, because heck yeah, heck yeah. Uh, but for now, we need to decide on a faction that we want to be out of the eight that are to choose from. And I am, I'm gonna just leave the screen for a few seconds on each of them. Uh, so so that uh, you can read about them. Uh, I'll do the same. Uh, but just so so you can uh, take a read and and see. And and of course I'm not I'm not leaving it there long enough for you to read every any everything. Uh, but you can pause and, and read about each of the factions. And I think that is a reasonable thing to do. So we're down to corn now. Let's go to Slanish and to Sinch. All right. So we have been able to read all of the different factions. And I am going to take a second to decide which one I want to be. So uh, give me just a few. Right, so I have decided that we are going to go with the Order Kingdoms. Uh, because who doesn't like a big burly dude who's sporting the color of a really bad baby diarrhea? So uh, that, that's who we're going with. And let's continue in. And we have a couple of choices here. Wow, he looks pleasant. So... We have uh, Greasus Goldtooth. He sounds nice. Uh, diplomatic relations plus 20 with Ogre Kingdoms. Income from trade plus 20%. Uh, unit mass plus 25%. Income from raiding plus 50%. Uh, upkeep minus 50% for Iron Guts units. Iron Guts and the Diarrhea color really don't go together. Uh, income from sacking and looting settlements plus 50%. Okay. Sounds good. What about the other dude? Scrag the Slaughter. Uh, campaign movement range plus 10% all characters. Now that's really nice. Hero capacity plus 1 for butchers. Hero recruit rank plus 2 for butchers. Uh, casualty replenishment rank plus 8 for Gorgers units. And upkeeps minus 50% for Gorgas units in the Lord's Army as well. Right. I, I kind of like the crown. I like the crown. Yeah. Yeah. I like the crown. Now, uh, I have played quite a lot of uh, Total War games. Uh, going back to uh, Medieval Total War, the second Total War game ever. Uh, I didn't play Shogun because Shogun came out in 2000. 
And at the time, I was, well, uh, 99, 2000, I was working as a tour guide in Egypt. Summer of 2000, I was working as a tour guide in Indonesia. And uh, winter uh, 2000, 2001, I was working as a tour guide, a uh, ski guide in uh, Italy. So, so I didn't play that. Uh, but uh, Medieval Total War, I did play. And I played quite a few since uh, Rome uh, and a few others. So, uh, so I'm not a noob to the Total War game. I'm not a noob to the Total War game. Though I think this guy is probably the coolest that I've seen. So let's uh, start here. We're, we're going to go on normal, normal for the difficulties because it has been a while since I've played and we we we, we want to win don't we we want to win now for some reason uh total war doesn't allow me to to select a 1440p uh resolution i can only do 1080 so so that's what we're playing in uh, but that's fine i guess uh it'll just be 1080p uh, but the videos will be available in 1440p as well, because that's the resolution of my screen. Uh, I think. I, I don't know, actually. I've never tried this before. Uh, that I couldn't play in the max res resolution of my screen. All right. The Flesh of the Bear. Feast to honor Greasus the Over-Tyrant. Their appetites are ferocious. I must be weary. Time is up, wizard. No. Put him in the stew. Wait, wait! Untold power can be harnessed from a dying god. Power? Ogres take what they want. What more power do we need? Boil the pot! Oh. <laughs> Please wait! The god is a bear! You can't devour it! Why? A bear, you say? Sounds tasty. Shut up! <sighs> and you meet God flesh. Ooh, sounds now, delicious. You, your warriors, and your god, the great maw. <sighs> I can smell it now. Roast god ribs. Ooh. Like no other. You're no meat eater. What's in it for you? My book reveals a path to his deathbed. I will show you the way for one drop of Ursula's divine blood. One drop. The ogres get the rest. That is the deal. Oh, yeah. Bit of god flesh. Who doesn't want that? All right, the war's to come. To claim Urson. The ogres will eat their weight in god flesh and throw the leftovers into the great maw. Sounds delicious. I'm getting hungry, Umi. Best start spitting out advice. Or I'm gonna use your bones as toothpicks. At once, Horde Master. The bear's roar has made the tribes restless. Other tyrants eye your mighty girth and are envious. The Cross Club's tribe plan to take your crown. Remind them who is the Over Tyrant. Destroy them and subjugate any other tribe that dares to withhold truth. Oh, yeah, baby. The Fire Mouth is a sacred site. Claiming it by force or bribery is a powerful act. And she'll give you a look at those sexy boys and westwards further south is the dwarf stronghold of Karak Azam. it should be cracked open and its riches added to your own for we will require immense wealth if you are to hire the best ogres to invade the chaos realms you will be busy mighty trade lord but the reward for your efforts is the god meat of Urson. let the feast begin for the great more hungers. Oh yes it does. Give me that meat. Alright. How they play. 
Meat. Ogre armies gain meat from battles from local settlements and from ogre camps, which they use for unit upkeep. Surplus meat may be sent to the Great Maw to gain bonuses. Ogre camps. Ogre armies may create camps in enemy territory to assist with recruitment and resupply. Big names. Some ogre lords and heroes may earn a name for themselves by performing certain feats. Once earned, a big name confer bonuses on the ogre character that bears it. Contracts. Ogre factions may be offered contracts from time to time by others to attack certain targets. Learn more about the ogre kingdoms here. Yeah, we'll, 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 we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Traitors and opportunists seek to wrest your crown and claim right, we have a mission. over tyrant for themselves. Defeat these pretenders. Right, we need to to defeat the initial army army that's fine where are we on the map um okay so we're on the way far east we're on the far east of the map fine okay so what do we have we have great hall of grasses Riasses? Ruse? Grrr? How the hell do you pronounce that? Great Hall of Griasses. Okay, let's say. And, um, I think the first thing I want to do is to get something building. Bullpen. Ogres are known as bulls lurk here, playing crude games of chance and waiting for their guts to crumble. To grumble. For hunger is a sign of food or fights, and probably both. Okay. Uh, income generated, 100. Now, that is definitely the way we're going. Uh, because, well, it, it's the only way. Uh, and, and income is, is just uh, not to be trifled with. So, here we have our... Do we have an army? Where, where's our army? Alright. Um, do we have an army? Uh, Grace's Goldtooth. Grace there he is. is and we want to take out this guy. Gar. Uh, we have some Noblars. Noblar Trappers. Stonehorn. Iron Guts and some Ogre Bulls. Okay. Let's go. Battle is upon us. Study your options carefully. The enemy are close. Blood will be spilt. Yeah, it will. And we are, of course, going to fight this battle. Even though it it is a decisive victory. It is the very first battle of the campaign, and we are going to fight it. That uh, there's just no two ways about it. Of course we're gonna fight it. Of course we're gonna fight it. It, it just can't be any other way, can it? We want to get into this, right? Now, one thing I'm seeing is that it's taking quite a bit. L well, it, it, it's quite a bit faster to load into the battles in Total War Armor 3 than it was in Total War Armor 2. Provided it keeps going up at the same rate thing, which is not. But it should be faster. That's what I've heard. That's what I've heard. And here we go. All right. Greatness in battle may only be reached through rigorous training. Even the most skillful of generals must practice their craft. Okay. That's fine. Uh, I don't think we need an introduction to battle for mental, uh, fundamentals. Uh, so what do we have here? Uh, you're a meat shield. Uh, hybrid unit. So you're missile infantry. You're a monster. Well, I, I can see that. And your armor. Okay, so we have 
So infantry, we don't have a lot of missile infantry. We basically have one. We have one missile infantry, which is up front, which is fine. I think we'll just go with the way it is. Uh, let's start. Um, we'll put you three into a group. We'll put you two into a group. We'll put you two into a group. And we'll put you two... Eh, you two can be alone. Alright, so, uh, group one. Let's... Um, now, I am rusty at this. Alright, let's move you up here. Are you shooting? You're shooting now. Okay. Uh, let's attack those guys. And we'll grab the two of you and get up here. I think I screwed up. I think I screwed up. But it's fine. We should be fine. Uh, let's get you in there. Yeah, yeah. We have you guys as well. Let's get in there and attack. You guys, run over there. This should be a fairly easy battle. Oh, that's good. Because I have no idea what I'm doing right now. <laughs> I, I seem to have lost all my my skills. But, uh, we want you to come in here, attack you, get in there, and man, it's dark, isn't it? It is dark. I do like the look of you, though. Your weird bike. That is pretty cool. He looks cool. All right, we're in there. Let's take him out. I don't care. Give them time to rest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, do I have anyone who is not fighting? If I do, then it's a mistake. Now, bear with me here, guys. Uh, it's been uh, quite a while since I played a Total War Warhammer game, and... I, I I need to uh, to skill up, you might say. So uh, let's end the battle. We did win. It was an easy one. It it's uh it's the start of battle. You always win this one. Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure I would have won, and it would have been uh, a bigger battle. But um, we'll we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out as we go along. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And. Let's go. Decisive victory. victory. Is yours, my lord. But what Outstanding. The fate of those captured in battle. It can be beneficial we to don't really. But sometimes leniency or brutality can be worth more. Yeah. Uh, I don't think we really need replenishment that much. I mean, we're we're fine. Let's. Let's get some meat. Let's get some meat. All right. Mission successful. Plus a thousand. Fantastic. Here we recruited a hunter. Okay, we got a hunter. Noise. 
through his recent actions, Greasus has unlocked the big name Horde Master. It can now be selected, conferring powerful bonuses to the character. Nice! Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, and passive ability Blood Clever. Blood Cleaver, sorry. Uh, hit points of combatants. Okay. I'll take it. A potent ally has joined your ranks. Fantastic. Them in your army. And plus 500 treasure again. Noise. Nice. Alright, so. You joined. Good blout. Okay, good blout. Good blout. Can you come over here, please? Beneath my abilities. He doesn't want to move. Gracious, this shockingly obese. Where's our guy? I don't see our guy. I yearn to be alone. I expect that it's good blout, but I can't move good blout. No trail to follow. An unworthy. Can you please? No quarry there. Gracious is better than that. Must <laughs> face. Is it because it seems that was open? the first of many challenges to your title and riches. Fresh recruits are needed. All right. Yeah, I, I agree. I smell All right, head over here. Uh, of hidden all right, good blout is coming in. The there we go. There we go. All right. Another 500. Man, we are swimming in money. Lord. All right, so... Uh, don't I have... I, I would expect that I have a... Well, well, we'll start that going for sure. The cap huddle. Acceleration, my wow, that that just seems bad, doesn't it? Population surplus one for newly deployed camps. Camp limit plus one. Army ability, army ability dismember all armies. Okay. With this, but we will go for that. And you have big name, Lord Master. Trade Lord or Geek Crash. Do we want to choose this name? Income from trade plus 4%, income from old buildings plus 10%, but only in the lo local province. Um, we'll choose that one for now. And then we have a level up. That's Can you go away? Uh, skill points. I can't click them. Uh, we, we, we'll give you the blood cleaver. Skills. There we go. And the first one that we're going with is always going to be Root Marcher. Because moving further on the campaign map is just... Invaluable. It's just invaluable. All right. So, where are we going? I guess we're going down to Grimtop. Amble Peak. No, let's go down to Grimtop. We're we're down this way anyway. Uh, so so let's head down this way. Uh. No, that's not what I wanted to click. I wanted to go to Diplomacy. So, Thunder Guts. Cross me, and your spine will 
Uh, we want to trade. And we want... Whoa! 4,681 ping? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. We, 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 we don't want to pay them that. Alright. So, we're, we're building that. We are heading down to Grimtop here to take that. And I think we're we're pretty good to go. We are good to go. And we have meat. Which is good. Uh, and and yeah, I, I, I think we're we we we're, we're ready to go. We're ready to go. And we will continue on in the next one. So guys. If you are excited for Total War Warhammer 3, if you are excited for the playthrough, please let me know by hitting the like button. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, uh, it would be great if you'd hit that subscribe button, maybe the notif notification bell as well, so that you know when videos are coming out. And I really appreciate you being here. Every little like, every little subscribe, every little comment, it uh, really helps out the channel, and if you do know about Warhammer lore, I would love to hear about it, because I I am very lacking in, in knowledge of that. So, uh, so yeah, uh, thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.